Hi, I'm Madge, and people call me a flying midge. You can hardly see me, I'm so small, but I do a lot of important work in my short lifespan of 10 days flying around. If it wasn't for me, you couldn't have any chocolate to eat. Let me explain. I live in the natural trash on the ground where it's nice and moist, next to cocoa trees. The banana remains and old cocoa pod husks collect the rainwater, and this is where I can lay my eggs. My eggs are laid in the still water, and after three days, my baby larvae crawl out. These larvae grow for 12 days and then form into a cocoon for the last three days. Then out we fly as mature midges to do the important work of pollination in the cocoa fields nearby to make sure you can have your chocolate. The chocolate you eat comes from cocoa beans, which grow in cocoa pods on cocoa trees. These cocoa trees grow only in tropical places, like the Caribbean. It's the flowers that I like on them. They have yummy food inside for me. While we visit and eat from this cocoa flower, we also perform the important work of pollination. You see, in nature, all fruit is formed on trees at a certain time of year. In season, a fertile tree produces flowers that can be transformed into fruit following fertilization. But fertilization requires a process called pollination. I carry out this important work by transferring pollen from one flower to another. We midges pollinate the cocoa flowers on these cocoa trees. These pollinated flowers become cocoa pods, which grow in size. When they're ripe, the cocoa pods are taken from the tree by farmers at reaping time. Inside these cocoa pods are many cocoa beans surrounded by a white pulp. These beans are then taken and converted to chocolate for you to eat and drink. So you see, we midges are very important. And so, we ask you to be careful with your environment. Do not pick the flowers off the trees or damage the tree trunks or branches where these flowers grow. When you take a cocoa pod off the tree, do not pull or twist the pod, as this will damage the flowering places called cushions, where new flowers sprout again. Please leave the natural trash on the ground where we live and breed. We like old cocoa pods and banana trash. It is our natural home. And finally, don't spray chemicals in our natural environment as it will kill us. If you take care of the cocoa trees and the environment, we midges can continue to pollinate the cocoa flowers that turn into cocoa pods that contain the cocoa beans from which fine, delicious chocolate is made for you to enjoy. Goodbye!